time now to reveal our first one. Chris is standing by because we're going to bring you the giant dreams of man and nature, and he's going to dazzle us with the leading candidate. Chris, take it away. All right, Diane, are you ready, everybody? Good morning, America, from the top of the highest man-made structure in the world. Welcome to the Burj Dubai, the Dubai Tower here in the United Arab Emirates. Can you believe how big this tower is? Take a look. Now look at the view. Look down there, you see these buildings, they look like little Legos. Those are 30 to 50 story tower buildings. Do you see this modest building across the way? It's almost as tall as the Empire State Building. Look at it compared to us. Right now, think of it this way. We are almost one half a mile up in the air. So if you want to talk about big, it does not get any bigger than this. In a city built to amaze, the Burj Dubai is in a class all its own. The tallest structure ever built by man, an engineering and architectural wonder. From the ground, you can't even see the top, which is still under construction. Let's take a look. Oh, yeah. Now I'll be safe. Soaring above the competition, the Burj dwarfs the previous title holder for world's tallest building, the Taipei 101 in Taiwan, which is 1,670 feet tall, 101 stories. But the Burj Dubai, designed by Chicago architects, looms largest with 160 stories. And at a reported 2,600 feet, it's nearly 1,000 feet taller, a difference the size of the Eiffel Tower. All told, it's higher than two Empire State Buildings stacked together. The building will house 5 million square feet of office space, a 175-room Armani Hotel, 900 apartments, four swimming pools, and the world's highest observation deck. The official height, still a secret even now, has been increased more than once during construction. We've got a lot of people around the world who want to build another building. The Chinese are trying, probably somebody else is trying. So we said, you know, let's just keep this number quiet for as long as we can. But there's little that's discreet about the Burj. The statistics, staggering. Over 10,000 workers logging over 29 million man hours in death-defying situations like these. Engineered with a six-sided central core to minimize the forces of wind, a critical factor on such a tall building, the Burj can sway over four feet. It took us 15 minutes just to get to the top, including using this small external elevator for the last leg. That is a sign you follow. A journey an astounding half mile into the sky. They say you can see this tower from 60 miles away. Now you know why. Wow, it is beautiful. All right, two more fun facts. There's enough concrete in this tower that you could make a sidewalk that's 1,200 miles long. And if you were to lay all the steel in this building end to end, Diane, it would go around a quarter of the globe. Can you believe that? Uh, it's just a breathtaking sight this morning, Chris, just looking down on those tiny little buildings that would be skyscrapers anyplace else.